Hi everybody, this is Doug and Steve from Open Meeting. We're recording in the recreated Rich and Jay boardroom. In fact, if you ever take a tour out here, you'll get a chance to see it. It's kind of fun to see a little bit of history. We're going now to the From the Archives where we take a look at something from, from our history and whatever it might be. I think we've got a recording today, don't we, Doug? We, we have a recording of your dad. We have oh. a recording of Jay from <laughs> 1980. The speech was Delegator Stagnate, one that uh, we remember well, but a fun segment that we'll uh, be able to talk about. Here we go. In every organization, we find it's made up of four kinds of people. The wishbones who spend all their time wishing somebody else would do the work, the jawbones who spend all their time talking but very little else, the knucklebones who knock everything that everyone else tries to do, and the backbones who get under the load and do all the work. And that's probably true in an Amway organization as well. Someone once put it this way, the hard part of making good is that you must do it every day and success depends upon the proper functioning of the glands, the sweat glands being the most important. Classic. It, it certainly is. <laughs> Although I totally remember dad talking about all those bones. In fact, he talked to me a lot about being a knuckle bone, at <laughs> least me every once in a while. <laughs> But, you know, backbone, when you think about what he's talking about with backbone, that's the case in almost everything you do, but it's certainly the case in our Amway business as well. I think Dad was really saying that, hey, the Amway business is there for everybody. Anybody can do it, but it takes a little bit of work. you got to take a look at what you're doing, what you want to do, and you gotta, you got you got to take the first step, and you got to continue those steps. You know, and I, every time we do this segment, it just everything applies so clearly <laughs> from, from, from that era to where we are today. You know, those are wishing for, those are talking about. I'm sure you and your groups, or maybe even you yourself, could see yourself going, gosh, I, I, I may have talked a lot or hoped a lot, but didn't quite do the work. And I think, you know, both our dads were pretty focused on doing the work and, and getting there, you know, doing the, the work necessary, sweating a little bit, making it happen, you know, selling products, sponsoring people, doing it over and over, helping one another. Uh, and that's it. I mean, there are parts of the Amway business that, that are just as true when we started yeah. as they are today. Yeah. And there are certain things that continue on and that's just who we are. And, and boy, when you start a business, you got to recognize it's going to take a little bit, a little bit of that work. On the other hand, sometimes you're thinking about it, sometimes you're talking about it, sometimes you're just complaining about it, right. but other times you step in and do it. Yeah. Yeah. And very fitting to have our From the Archives segment here in the Rich and Jay Recreated Boardroom because not only their dinner table, <laughs> but around that board table too. <laughs> I, remember we, I remember a few sessions uh, in the same way. So uh, what a great fun time. Uh, what a great uh, uh, memory that we have to share with you. So I hope it's impactful for you too. Thanks for joining us here at uh, Open Meeting and the From the Archives segment, and we'll see you soon.